We're gonna deal with weird lighting, are we? Am I gonna do that? There we go. We're just gonna use a natural lighting because I just don't feel like hooking up the ring light this morning, so I'm not going to. Hi, thanks for joining. The whole purpose and point in me doing this with you today is so that you have some real tips, tricks, and tools that you can use in your own business. So join me, ask questions, get support, answer questions. Um, let me demystify it for you and keep the magic and mystery that's fun and get rid of the magic and mystery that is not fun, which is how the hell do you make money in your business? Um, Realizing I've got to plug things in. Okay, that was my cell phone that needed to be plugged in. We good. Life is crazy. If some of you guys saw my life update on Friday, we signed a contract for our dream house. I'm so excited. I will tell you the full manifestation story as it reveals itself. And then Saturday, we had pictures of this house taken. And then it was listed on the market Monday. So it's just been like, ah. And then, of course, of course, my son's daycare is closed today because of a COVID case. So it's like, here we go. So I moved this live. It's normally at um, in the afternoon at 3 o'clock. But I moved it today because I want to still come live and give you some juice and invite you into Sacred Sales Priestess. We are officially in early bird sales for Sacred Sales Priestess. I am so excited about this program, you guys. This is the program to take if you're not making what you want to make in your business. This is the program to take if you're a healer and you're like, I help people, but I'm not quite sure how to charge money. And I'm going to demystify some of that for you today and tell, talk you through my method for healers of how to charge and make money and help other people and do it in a way that lights you up, that feels good and nourishing to your body mind and spirit. So feel free to ask questions. Uh, this is a bit behind the scenes, definitely off the cuff. I went to write an outline for this and literally all I have down is from 25 to 2k. Talk about it. So that's what we're going to do. Um, so a lot of you know, I was a HR recruiter before this business. I got into human resources because it was the only thing where I could work with people and get paid. Uh, it was 2007. I had just graduated with my master's degree. I ended up working for $13.50 an hour at the Yankee Candle Company as an HR administrator. And I hated most of my corporate career because I thought that I was going to get to help people. And I did help them by offering them jobs, but there was so much about the structure and the dog-eat-dog -dog world of capitalism and corporate America that I just hated. And so I started developing, what the hell was I going to do if I didn't do this job? And I fell in love with business and marketing and sales. Now, as a recruiter, I had been doing sales for years, over a decade, but it was selling somebody else's business and somebody else's work and benefits. But I really learned how to speak to what that particular person wanted and if I had the right thing that was for them at the right time. So. I've cultivated these sales skills that actually feel good to me over 15 years. A lot of people have been asking, well, what books do you recommend? There's not many people that I like to listen to for sales. There's a lot of junk out there and a lot of things that'll make you feel like you're doing something gross. And I don't think we have to do gross things in our businesses in order to make money. They just don't believe that. I don't do it. My clients don't do it. You don't have to do it either. So. That's what I'm teaching in Sacred Sales Priestess is how do you be that divine channel for this beautiful work that you're doing with your people and receive money and do it in a way that feels good. The reason it's a live program over seven weeks is because that shit takes time. It takes time. And so I will be there one on one coaching with you in the group coaching calls and in the Facebook group. And you're going to get modules in there as well. Click the link, check it out, DM me with questions. But if you're not making what you want to make, that program's for you. Now, how did I go from 25 to 2K? I started off by offering 60-minute phone calls to people. I was My original niche was helping people figure out what the hell they were going to do if they didn't work their corporate job and how. And so I would get on $25 phone calls with folks, and I didn't know what I was doing. I was flubbing my way through it, asking questions. I am not a certified coach. I had to figure this shit out for myself. 
What works with my clients? What doesn't? What questions did I need to ask to help them get to where they wanted to go? So I charged $25 for a 60 minute phone call. That was it. And I had friends and family reach out first. Friends and family are generally our early adopters. They're the first ones who are gonna be like, don't know really what you're doing, Susie, but I wanna support you, so let's do this. Great, let them support you. And you get to charge money for your work in the world. So $25 is some amount of money, right? There's some skin in the game, so to speak, for both them and for you. But it's not so high of a dollar amount that you feel like, oh my God, I've got to over deliver. What the fuck am I even delivering on, right? If you started out by charging $2,000 for a 60 minute phone call, that's probably not going to feel very good because you're like, I don't, I'm not, I don't know if I can promise this level of transformation. That's okay. You don't have to start out by doing that. You can literally say, okay, it's $25 for a phone call and we'll go from there. And that's enough. That's fine. So, The whole point in stair-stepping prices is that you get to work with people, you get to charge money and make money, and you actually get to help somebody. Because I don't know about you, but I would rather have clients than no clients. And if that means in the early days charging $25, then so be it. And for me, that's really what I felt that I could do. Now I only charge that rate for maybe two or three months. $25, 60 minute phone calls, And then I ran workshops. I ran free workshops, $5 workshops, $10 workshops, $25 workshops, $25 workshops for someone else's audience, right? Getting in front of other people's audiences, having your friends, your peers, your mentors vouch for you. Super important, really powerful. And then I would get into one-on-one phone calls from there from people who were interested in working with me. And I started developing a theory based on personal experience and these conversations and working with people, figuring out, well, how does someone quit their day job and do work they love? What's the step-by-step process? And I created this structure. I created this foundation. And now it's an evergreen program. But originally I ran it live and I called it Make a Plan. And I helped people figure out what their quitting plan was. Some people are like, yep, I'm gonna quit my day job, start my business, and they just do it. If you're like me, you need a plan. I needed a plan. And I developed this plan for my clients over time with worksheets, with modules, with live sessions. And I worked with people and tweaked it and developed it specifically for them. This is key, you guys. This part right here, write this down, journal it, come back to it, we're almost eight minutes in. This part's key. You're a healer. Your work is informed by other people. When you work with other people, it makes your work better. If you create this massive, huge program for people, but you don't know what they need, you haven't worked with them, you haven't asked them questions, you haven't figured out how to craft it and tweak it and mold it to help them get the result and the outcome that they want, everything you know all nice and buttoned up and it was going to work for people and it didn't work because I didn't know what they needed right but if you build it piece by piece $25 offer $99 offer when I launched make a plan it was a 30-day program one-on-one for $147 it was three or four calls and I think I made seven modules uh, seven worksheets And then I pulled it out from there. And I charged more with each person who came through the door because I got better at it. I was more confident in my work. I knew what I was doing. They got the results faster and I felt good charging more money, right? That program topped out at 789, something around there, almost $800 where I was like, "Mm, $800 for a month with modules, pre-recorded trainings, three or four live coaching calls in between Voxer support, like, It was a nice chunk of time and container. And then I made it into a group program, right? Because I felt like, okay, one-on-one coaching, I learned a lot, I helped over 30 people make their unique plan. I knew enough to then craft a program where more people could get results faster. It took less of my one-on-one time and energy and attention. And they still got what they needed, which was their quitting plan and the beginnings of what type of business they would wanna build. Now from there, I realized I really loved working with people one-on-one and I really loved helping them craft the foundation of a healing arts online business. And so that's what I started doing. 
is really helping people more with that process. I launched my one-on-one coaching from there. And when I launched it, I think I charged, this was a bit of a jump and a little scary, but it wasn't a jump from the make a, make a plan program, right? So I charged $777 a month for one-on-one coaching, or I broke that down into a long extended payment plan as well. And I had four clients hop in for that program. I sold that program literally through video calls with me and a shared Google Doc. Did not have a sales page, barely had an articulation of a website. I had a social media presence, I had this group, and I had my Google Doc. That was it. And I had a lot of business coaching and some sales and marketing training. And so I charged month to month. I created modules of what I wanted to take people through in a six month mentorship program. And I think I charged, yeah, it was 777 a month. And from there, I just made it better and better and better. I think I've launched my one-on-one coaching one other time since then. I've never fully launched it again because people end up DMing me and asking if they can work with me. And I only hold five one-on-one coaching spots open at a time. So they fill right? And now I charge $2,000 a month for one-on-one coaching. And that's after three years of being in my business and making it better and better. And I have a program suite that they get access to, my one-on-one clients, and they can hop in the mastermind for 50% off. I also have a mastermind, which is literally the pricing that my one-on-one coaching once was because I can help people get results faster because I've practiced. So the key, dear healer, is to getting out in the world, charging money for what you do, getting paid and helping people. And then based on those people, you make it better. You make it better. And then you can charge more and you feel good about charging more because your time and energy is valuable. But you don't have to jump out of the gate charging $1,000 a month, especially if it's gonna jolt your nervous system. You get to create a sacred sales process. You get to invoke pray, commune with the divine, work your magic, and make your service an offering. And that is exactly what we're going to do in Sacred Sales Priestess over seven weeks together. This is the most inexpensive way to work with me, and it's going to be so freaking juicy. I am really excited. I'm only offering it once a year. This is it. If you want to be making the money you crave, this program is for you. I don't care who you are. I don't care what stage of business you're in. If you want to make more money and feel good about it and you are a healer, you need this program. So hop in with me. DM me if you have questions. I hope this talk helped you demystify how to go from $25 to $2,000 if that's what you want to do. If you want to stop somewhere along the path, you get to do that. You don't have to have a seven-figure business. You don't have to have a six-figure business. It is plenty enough to want a $50,000 a year business and to help people thoroughly, you get to have whatever you want. Now it's all about deciding. Hop in for Sacred Sales Priestess. Join me, let me help you make the sales you wanna make and have a beautiful day.